Welcome to this quick video on using alternate colour in Google Sheets to make your tables easier to read. So I've got a table of data here, it's all got a white background on there, it's quite hard to see the different rows and it's just, it's just not super simple to read or anything like that. So there's a really quick function you can use in Google Sheets to make it just much more visually friendly and easy to identify. So I'm just going to select my whole table, including the headers, so including the column headers, and then I'm just going to go to Format and Alternating Colours. And when I do that, you can see Alternating Colours comes up on the right hand side. If I hadn't selected the range, I could select it at this point. So it, I, it does say it has a header. I haven't ticked the footer option. Obviously, if you didn't select the column headers, then you wouldn't put it in. But it makes sense to select it and have that a consistent style across the full table that you are selecting the full data set. And you can see there I've got different styles that I can use for colors or custom styles. If I've got some branding I'm going to be looking at. And then I've got a few options there to play around with it. So if I can click on done and I can just come away, you can see there now, if I zoom in a little bit, so let me just zoom in. It's much easier to see when we are a little bit closer. There is a slight color difference there between the two, the rows. So when it's printed, you'll be able to see that. And obviously you can go in and amend that if you want it to be a little bit more obvious. So I just wanted it subtle, just to help the users sort of read what they were going through there. But if I went into alternating colors, I could obviously go in and color two there. Might just need to be a little bit of a more solid gray. If I click done, no much changes on there because I can't see that. Whoops. I need to, that's what I did. It happens to the best of us. I need to go in and select it first and format alternating colors and make sure I've selected. And you can see as soon as I've done that, that changes on the table. So I can really bespoke what I want to do and make it pop out. So let's just make it a little bit less obvious there, but you can still see there's some different colors on your table to make it easier for your users and you to read that data. So a nice little formatting tip there to help you out with tables in Google Sheets and just to make them more readable. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know what videos you'd like me to record next.